many people think they have an abundance of resources, but it's finite. You know, water is limited, oil is limited, but the wind is forever. As people begin to understand that wind energy can occur and, uh, and, the, and the, the resources, the wildlife resources can coexist with it, um, that's, a, that's a key. It's God's country up here. We've got to protect our forests and our, and our water and our, all our natural resources that we have. I think it's really exciting. I mean, we've got to be competitive with what's going on in the world today. And I just think it's an awesome opportunity to have that right here in our backyard. Well, the wind farm provides a real nice tax base for our taxpayers, $500,000 per year it will wind up reducing the tax burden on all our homeowners and landowners by about 20%. Initially I thought that the, uh, the uh, wind generators would be a negative on the mountain. I found that uh, after they were up and after they were running, uh, they weren't a negative to me. Uh, they're interesting and really I find myself uh, watching them and uh, seeing which way they're turning. So now they've become part of uh, daily life in that respect. They were able to reduce everyone's town taxes over 30%. Even if you didn't have a turbine, you still saw a dramatic decrease in your town taxes. The impact of, of the wind turbines has been really substantial on our local economy. It's allowing us to, to do things that we, we never thought we could do before. The more we can get away from that foreign oil, the better. Because the price keeps going up on that. The price of the wind don't go up any. As far as we can get more nationwide, the better off we are. Wind power actually it increases the reliability of the system. It adds to the diversity of the generation mix. It helps stabilize the reliability of our system. The wind farm saves the island of Maui 600 barrels of oil per day. This is a power plant. This is a 20 megawatt power plant that we're standing on. And um, it, it contributes to the grid like any other power plant. As a, a, a member of my town government, I can't think of a better legacy that I could have left for my town. Each of us needs to understand that we're part of the demand for electricity and we have a choice about where that electricity comes from and we get to make that choice every once in a while when somebody says, I'd like to put a wind power project in your town or in your county or in your state. It's an opportunity for us to make a choice that says, that's how I'd like to get my electricity.